Not when I was expecting to find player heads. Holy crap. Okay, well, let's dump all this junk into here. We are taking all these shulker boxes. I mean, I figured there might be some active stronghold locations, but I did not expect to find a whole bunch of shulker boxes here. There we go. Not a bad haul. That was really cool what we found in those shulker boxes. There were a few heads of various players I don't know anything about, but that's awesome. However, it's not the best thing that we got today. You see, we received an inheritance. Do you remember when we found the spawn base that was being camped by some dude named Condestat? He quit Minecraft and he decided to give me everything he owns. Take a peek. <laughs> So absolutely massive thanks to Condestat for being so generous. I know he's quitting. I'm sad to see him go. He seems like a really great guy, but we are now considerably richer and we have a lot more materials to work with. So thank you again. Let's keep on our stronghold hunt. I'm recording these clips starting about here quite a while after I recorded the previous clips and a little bit has changed since then. The map that we've been using for this video and the past video is actually really inaccurate, I realized, so I had to redo the whole thing and it took a really long time, but um, we're also keeping the map private for now because we're working on a little bit of a project. I don't even want to give any sort of clues what is going on. Um, but we're, we're keeping the map private until we've finished our project, so I'm not going to be popping up the map anymore and showing you how complete everything is, unfortunately. We are making really good progress with finding these strongholds, though, and it has been super fun going along. Me, Thesto, and Melwin are the three people who are working on this. I will say this, there are eight rings of strongholds, like I talked about last video. They, you know, go in concentric circles from spawn. There are eight of those. We are very, very close to having found all the portals in five of those rings. Some of the, the further out rings have a lot of portals per ring, so we've, we've still got a while to go. We are making really good progress on finding every single portal in purity. Hey, this is one of the portals that Robert has found. Robert is that guy who I talked about last episode. Uh, he goes around and he's found several of the portals himself. It's kind of interesting, I don't remember if I mentioned it last video, but people have gotten really mad at me for trying to go and find all these portals and eventually publicize all of their locations. Um, some people want to keep them to themselves. Some people are, are working on projects and things that use them or just don't want people to, to figure out where these things are. So, I guess Robert D. Portal, Project Columbus. Again, we are in Project Marco. He started this Project Columbus, which I didn't even know existed until I started hunting for these ender portals. And I think it's his personal project of trying to find each ender portal by himself. I don't know if he's, his goal is to find all of them, but I would, I would assume it might be. Our project is Project Marco, also named after a famous explorer. Our project is to find every single end portal on the map for both seeds, all three seeds, but I don't know the third seed. If you do know the third seed, hit me up on Discord though. 
and then not to keep them to ourselves, but to give them to the entire community for the community to use as they see fit. Again, just to give you a little bit of scale of, of how many portals we've actually found out of the approximately 128 due to seed changes and map corruptions and all that. I, by myself, have found 29. I'm pretty happy with that number, to be honest. I really want to get to 50, though. We're having some chunk border activity, which concerns me, because it may mean that there has been a seed change around here. Could also just mean a version change, which is less bad, but it still causes issues. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Very nice, and there is a stronghold here. We'll see if there's actually an end portal. We've actually found strongholds that generate and they're they're there they're where they're supposed to be but they don't always have portals we found one that we think was cut off by an ocean monument spawning where the portal was supposed to spawn we'll have to double check some of those locations make sure that we did it right but we have found some crazy things <laughs> there's another portal this looks like a good sign hey Opened Halloween 2021 by Splash. Splash was a major highway builder, so that's really cool to see something found by him. This is kind of interesting, we've got this whole town right here. This whole little village set up, all these chests and everything, and some language I don't know, German maybe? And they probably don't have any idea how close they were to this stronghold. I wonder if anybody's discovered this one. Uh-oh. This isn't good. I don't have the exact Y coordinate of it, so it could be lower. But usually if I get that low, it means there's nothing. But this is not one of those times. Hey! <laughs> awesome. Doors are open. Torches on the ground. This one has been discovered. Oh, this is cool looking. This one goes into a ravine. Hey, hey, spawner broken and portal activated. We found it. I hate finding the portals within the strongholds. It just takes me so long, but here we go. Not a good sign. Okay. Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is why we carry totems. Woo! But we survived. Okay, so. <laughs> that was full. There is no stronghold here. Meaning, either I put in a incorrect coordinate, did not. Uh, meaning we are probably in seed 2 right now. Let me double check by pulling up the biomes. Yeah, we are in seed two right now. Sometimes the cutoff for the seeds are so close. The portal is supposed to be, you know, the stronghold's supposed to be right there. This is how close we came to generating this particular portal. If a, if a person had come across here when seed one was active, they would have generated the stronghold. But since they didn't come far enough and this was generated in seed two, no portal exists here. And that's when I put a red marker on the map. I don't know why I think this is so funny. I just love speeding through the air at mock speed. Oh my gosh. All right, here we be. Oh dear, goodness. Oh dear. Oh dear. What happened here? What? What? Somebody really doesn't like strongholds! <laughs> Dear goodness! I don't even know where... Oh, I hear... I'm starting to hear the skulls. So I bet they're down there. Yeah, there's one. Why... Why would someone wither a stronghold? This one is active. It's... Why is it like this? With that though, we only have one more portal left for this ring that I'm working on right now. If anybody knows who griefed this place or what it used to be, I would be fascinated to learn. Anyways, we only have one more portal in the current ring that I'm working on. However, um, some of the people I'm working with on this project have found some really cool looking portals and I want to I wanna go see them for myself. 
So we're going to head to one that's 20,000 blocks away. So all I've seen of this place so far is a couple screenshots. I would love to see more places like where we're about to go uh, along our journey. I love going through the overworld because we can base hunt and everything. I'm really hoping that we find ender portals where people have done something to them. They've built a base around them or they've, you know, made it look all fancy or something like the one we are about to see any second it should pop into view. Whoa, there's, there's these big towers? I didn't even know that. Look at this. It's huge. It doesn't even fit in my render distance. Look at this. Oh, there's a bunch of signs as well. Very nice place. Atronmas. Who built this place, though? It doesn't. It doesn't seem to say who built it. The portal's active and everything. Oh, is there an interior? Bruh. Look at this thing. Totally have to get some screenshots of this. There's a dog. Whose dog is that? This is by far my favorite ender portal that we found so far, and I really hope there are more like this. This is the last portal of the ring that I'm working on right now. So once we complete this, we'll have five full rings done. Here goes nothing. I saw some stuff on the ground, yep. This place has been discovered. Not looking too promising, though. If we're on seed one, it should be just down here. It is! It is! There was a portal! There was a portal! I told you there was probably a portal! There was a portal! I've been looking for this for so long! <laughs> we finally found it! And that's our ring complete! So thank you very much for watching! We will continue this hunt, and I am having an absolute blast! Um, hopefully we'll be able to find some bases along the way and everything, but for the time being, I hope you are enjoying our, our hunt for these portals, and if you do enjoy them, please make sure you leave a like and a comment below, but that's it for me. Thank you very much for watching, I'll see you next time. Goodbye!